All right, this is Double Double J whipping with Joe. We're talking about snaring, crab snares here. Um, it's raining outside, so we're gonna do this in the inside of the garage. Let me turn the lights on here. Let me turn some lights on. Here. Lights on. Anyway, anyway, yeah. Uh, so uh, we were talking about what reels work, and then the other ones will work with the caskings. Um, I don't know if you can see this here, but this is a casking 5000 here. That's what I recommend. As well, I feel tested the 3000 and the 4000. Uh, like those reels, and then uh, we got the 5000, like the crank. Uh, this is made out of casking actually. So you can see this guy here. Yeah, this is a casking here, casking 5,000. It's about 21 ounces. And then we've got this big guy here, man. <laughs> this is a monster. Look at this reel, man. It's casking 8,000. It's huge, huge capacity. Here's the biggest, big stuff here 260 yards or 60 pound braid or something like that. The ratio is fine. One, so it's easy to crank in the big snares. And we've got this. Crab snare specials. One of them, the uh, Okuma. And then we got the Okuma Rockaway. That's the rods we use it to catch the crabs. I thought I shared it with you. So, this guy is huge though. It's the biggest reel in the inventory. He's got 80 pound braid on him, man. Anyway, yeah. So, the ones you're gonna use are really easy. We works real well the caskings. We got the five and the the 6,000, the 5,000, and the 8,000. The Spheros 2014, slow ratio with the PG 21, uh, Spheros 21, works well. And then um, the uh, Shimano 5,000, and then the Okuma 55P that works very well. Worked in the last trip we went. I may thought I shared with you, but this is the Okuma. Not a cool about casket. So I got all these models number. Right? And this bug's huge. Aloha.